Good afternoon. I think it's only fitting that an African-American Vietnam veteran uh, does the benediction. We pray in the name of Allah, the most beneficent, the most merciful. Praise be to God, the Lord of all beings, the merciful, the beneficent, master of the day of judgment. You alone we worship and you alone we call upon for help. Guide us on the straight path, the path of those whom you have favored, not of those who have incurred your anger or go astray. Our Lord, we have gathered here today to understand and to learn from each other regarding the continued legacy of speaking a fundamental truth established by Dr. Carter G. Woodson regarding a missing part of American history and about the preservation, promotion, research, interpretation, dissemination of information about black life, history, and culture. We ask that you grant us the insight to see the truth as truth and grant us the moral courage to openly proclaim it and abide by it. Lord, we grant us uh, the insight to see evil in its true colors, no matter what others may say, and save and preserve us from it. Lord of Ibrahim, the great prophet and patriarch of the three religious traditions, help us to follow his footsteps, submit ourselves to you as he had completely submitted to you. Our Lord, we believe in you in the revelation sent to us and to Ibrahim, Ismail, Isaac, Jacob, and the tribes, and that given to Moses, Jesus, and Muhammad, and that given to all the prophets from their Lord, we make no difference between one and the other of them, and we bow to you in obedience. Our Lord, you are the light of the heavens and the earth. Give us the light to walk in, to live in, and to be guided by. Our Lord, there are indeed clear signs in the creation of the heavens and the earth, and in the alternation of night and day. For those of your sincere servants who celebrate your praises, standing, setting, lying down on their sides, and ponder over the wonders and creation in the heavens and the earth, and cry out, Ya Rab, our Lord. You have not created all this universe in vain. Glory be to you. Our Lord, make us amongst those wise people, and open our hearts and minds to your call. We have heard the call of one calling us to faith. We believe in you. We are weak and we need your help. Give us the strength to respond. Our Lord, make us of those who listen and follow the words that you have sent and the best meaning of it. Free us from our weaknesses, our prejudices, our biases, our hatreds, and ill feelings toward each other. Create sympathy, empathy, and understanding, and love in our hearts for all. And give us the ability to engage in an honest, sincere, and beautiful dialogue. free from recrimination <clears throat> and negative feelings, we ask that the positive impact of this conference, particularly this gathering and its presenters, affect the insights and sensibilities far beyond the confines of this space. And we close by saying, Subhana rabbika rabbil izzati amma yasifun wa salamun ala al-mursaleen wa alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Glory to you, O Lord, the Lord of honor and power, and peace be on the messenger, and all praise and thanks is due to Allah, Lord of the worlds. Amin, amin, amin.